Did you know you can control your climate control system using your voice and the touchscreen? In fact, there are several ways to do it and a few cool features you want to know about. Let me walk you through it. Touching the climate icon at the bottom of the screen will allow you to adjust your climate settings. From here, you can do several things, like increase or decrease the temperature in the whole vehicle by pressing the up or down arrow on the driver's side, or set a separate temperature for the driver and front passenger. To do that, press either the dual mode button or the passenger side up or down arrows. If at any time you want to turn dual mode off, just press the dual button and the temperature will match the driver's side setting. From the same screen, you can control the air conditioner by pressing the AC button and a menu will appear. Here, you can turn max AC, normal AC, and recirculating air on or off, or close the menu. On colder days, pressing the defrost button will give you additional defrost controls, like max defrost for heavy ice buildup, normal defrost, rear defrost, and close. To adjust the temperature with voice commands, use the voice button and say climate. Then tell Sync what temperature you want. For example, set temperature to 72 degrees. Did you say 72 degrees? Yes. Still with me? Great. You can also use these controls to turn the climate feature on or off and adjust the fan speed. And control whether you want the airflow to come through the instrument panel vents or the floor vents. For your added comfort, you can run your system in automatic or auto mode. The auto function will run the heat or air conditioning as needed to get to the temperature you've set. Meaning, if the temperature in the car is warmer than the set temperature, cool air will start to blow. If the temperature in the car is cooler, warm air will blow. In addition, air distribution and fan speed will be set automatically. Okay, there are a couple more features you'll want to know about, like available heated and cooled front seats and a heated steering wheel. The heated seat icons have lines and the cooled seats are marked with AC. To turn them on or off from either the home screen or the climate control screen, press the matching icon. While in either mode, press the icon once to turn it on and again to adjust it down or off as needed. Press your heated steering wheel icon on either the home screen or the climate control screen to turn it on or off. And finally, there is also a separate rear temperature control that can be adjusted by the driver that sets the rear cabin area's temperature and fan speed separately from the front cabin. Any questions? Go to owner.ford.com.